Oh, just because he was in, in front of Congress. Let me see if I can find this. He was in front of Congress now, just a few minutes ago. And um, yeah, testifying in front of Congress, RFK said, uh, he basically said, under oath, under oath, that he has never been an anti-vax and he's never told the public to avoid vaccination. Never told the public to avoid vaccination and never been an anti-vax. That's what he said, right? You know, he, he said he, he's selective, he wants research, he wants people to evaluate, he wants people to think about it, all this stuff. But he never, he's not anti-vax and he never told people not to take vaccines, right? Here's a quote from him from a podcast a couple of years ago, 2021. Uh, he says, our job is to resist and to talk about it to everybody. If you're walking down the street and I do this myself, which is, uh, you know, I don't want to do, I'm, I'm not a busybody. I see somebody on a hiking trail carrying a little baby and I say to him, better not get his, him vaccinated. And he heard that from me. If he hears it from 10 other people, maybe he won't do it. You know, maybe he will save their child. And uh, before, uh, before we were all quiet because we wanted to get along with our families, we just uh, take endless flack. If you talk about this issue, people are scared. Uh, you're going to get marginalized from your community, uh, that people are going to call you crazy or whatever. But now is the time to come out of the closet. And there's probably thousands of quotes uh, where he's clearly anti-vax and clearly telling people not to get vaccinated. <laughs> um, don't have your child vaccinated is anti-vax for children. So he's not against all vaccination. Uh, ask him what vaccinations he's for, you'll probably get a blank stare. Um, but, you know, just, again, the, the, the lying, the, the sheer bold lying that now is just a part of our, our, what we expect of our politicians. They, they, they just look at the camera and they, they state bold lies. They do it with a certain, you know, panache. And... Um, Nobody cares, and, and they're forgiven, and everybody moves on. Uh, it doesn't matter. So, yeah, I mean, the guys, the guys, are, as we've said in that case, I'm sure we'll talk about this a bit, little bit with Amish um, later today, uh, tonight.